Here we're asked to divide two polynomials. To do that, we'll use polynomial long division. We begin by deciding what factor times 3x will be equal to 6x to the fourth. After some thought, we choose 2x to the third, and then multiply, remembering to apply the distributive property. 2x to the third times 3x is equal to 6x to the fourth. 2x to the third power times negative 2 leaves us with minus 4x to the third. Now at this point, the division algorithm requires that we then subtract. 6x to the fourth minus 6x to the fourth is zero. And when we subtract a negative term, we're really adding. So negative 13x cubed plus 4x cubed leaves us with negative 9x to the third. And then bring down the rest of the terms. Next, we ask what times 3x will be equal to negative 9x to the third. And we choose negative 3x squared. Negative 3x squared times 3x is equal to negative 9x to the third. Negative 3x squared times negative 2 leaves us with plus 6x squared. Then subtract. 9x squared minus 6x squared is 3x squared. Bring down the terms and ask what times 3x will give us 3x squared? Well, in this case, plus x will do it. x times 3x is 3x squared. x times negative 2 is negative 2x, after which we then subtract. Negative 14x minus negative 2x is really the same as negative 14x plus 2x. Leaves us with negative 12x plus 6. Now we ask what times 3x is equal to negative 12x? We choose negative 4. Negative 4 times 3x is negative 12x. Negative 4 times negative 2 is plus 8. After then, we subtract. And that leaves us with 6 minus 8, or negative 2 as the remainder. So we can add a term with negative 2 divided by the divisor, in this case, 3x minus 2. And so this is our answer. All that is left to do is present it with the remainder term here. Instead of plus a negative term, we'll say minus this. And so our answer is 2x cubed minus 3x squared plus x minus 4 minus 2 over 3x minus 2.